this is our app called CRS. Now we have to log in using MetaMask Wallet. Once we log in using MetaMask Wallet, uh, then we can access our crime reporting system. It's a simple UI. We can enter uh, the district, the area where the problem was, title, description, photo, and video. Uh, this thing, this listing, we can change uh, as per our need. We developed the system uh, for big uh, problems like that happen in Manipur and places like that where uh, if any person is cited to report this kind of things and uh, somebody knows they are the ones uh, who reported then maybe their life will be in danger or their family's life will be in danger uh, in that kind of situations you can use this reporting system this is blockchain based uh, and it is completely secure uh, nobody can trace you and even the uh, uh, people who are in the back end like who are accessing the information you was been uh, that has been sent won't know who is the one sending this information uh, that will be completely masked and uh, that's the main benefit of this and now the report has been submitted successfully uh, this report will be sent to blockchain and then uh, from there from that and this is the back end dashboard uh, in this dashboard uh, we Currently only one report has been reported. The report that has been reported by me just a few seconds ago. We can see the report by just clicking on the report tab uh, and selecting the report ID. So here is the report we reported earlier with the district Ernakulam and the place Alwa. Also the images and the videos we uploaded can be seen here. It will be called from the IPFS directly to here. It won't be stored in any storages like uh, any internet storages it be directly called from there so the data is reliable so the next part is access only the other person can access uh, the entire thing after that uh, if you want if he want anybody to access this he can give access using grant access tab where he just have to put the uh, public id of the metamask wallet of the person who he wants to give access and just approve the contract then it will give a message uh, that will show it successfully uh, granted the access uh, we can see in the met, uh, remix where we deployed everything uh, there are two metamask ids who has access right now this is the remix tab uh, remix where we wrote the contract and deployed it this is the entire contract and this is the contract address gave access right now to that id that's why they showed two public ids then also we can revoke the access by just clicking on the revoke access we just have to put the same id like the one we put earlier here and just approve the contract if we approve the contract after some seconds we can see uh, the access will be revoked here we can uh, see the uh, status of the entire operation uh, now it's uh, revoked successfully then we can uh, look into the address only one at access now this is how the entire access thing works then we can just look into our code also this is the organization tab where our entire code is CRS that will be shared uh, with the YouTube description thank you